Pace. This is Mahogany Homeschooler and today I wanted to share with you the daily lesson plan sheet that I created using WordPerfect. You can use WordPerfect, Microsoft Word or whatever spreadsheet program you have on your computer. I used to use the lesson planner books and the agenda books that you buy in the stores but I found that it really wasn't accommodating my needs being as though I had multiple children. So I got on my computer and started playing around with the columns and the rows and I came up with this format and it's really been working well with me for the past couple of years. Um, here, I created a space where I can put the homeschool name, the date, and this is where you would put your children's names so that you would know what assignments are directed at what child and the subject matter. We have math reading, writing, grammar, vocab and spelling, geography, social studies, science, and art. And any other subjects that you will be working with, um, foreign languages, Latin, whatever you know your children are working on, you can customize this based on their needs. And you can print it out whenever you need them, save it to your computer, and you don't have to worry about going out buying any more agenda books. You can sit down, play around with your software, and create the exact sheets that you need for your family. This one is a daily sheet. I have a uh, monthly unit study sheet that I use, but this is for the daily coursework that I give them, the math, the basic things that they do every day. And I'm trying to turn it so you can see it. And within that, after I created the rows and the columns, I just did the lines in each individual row. And like I said, you're gonna save so much money, you won't have to go out and buy a whole bunch of lesson planner books every year. You can customize this each year as your family grows or if your children are graduating off to college, or whatever the case may be. You can play around with this so that it fits your exact needs. And then you can go out and buy a binder for a dollar and at the end of the year, you have your portfolio of everything you've done that year and you can easily store it away in a box, a file folder, cabinet, or whatever. And if you need to pull this out in the future, it's very easily accessible and it's right there for you. So, homeschooling on a budget and outside of the box, peace.